Studio Movie Grill is an American dine-in movie theater chain that started in 1993. Thank you for your suggestion. Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby to get ourselves a treat. Delicious things to eat. The popcorn can't be beat. The sparkling drinks are just dandy. The chocolate bars and the candy. So let's all go to the lobby. The Studio Movie Grill first started out in 1993 as the Granada Movie Grill Prestonwood in Dallas, Texas. The founder, Brian Schultz, worked in the political sphere as an aide to the late United States Senator from Pennsylvania, Arlen Specter. During Schultz's tenure with Senator Specter, he attended a film at the Bethesda Cinema and Draft House in Maryland and immediately fell in love with the concept of serving food while watching a movie. This experience planted the seed for what would become Studio Movie Grill, his first in-theater dining company, opening the first of several locations in 1993. His first venture, the Granada Movie Grill, modernized the traditional movie-going experience by combining first-run movies with full-service in-theater dining. The theater featured five screens with private luxury boxes and valet parking. In an early interview, Schultz said in our early years, we couldn't get first-run features. Basically, all of the movie theater restaurants in those early days were like us. In older theaters, that had one screen, maybe two, and therefore we were able to get sub-run movies, movies that reached the end of their first run and would soon be released on video. The first run movie that was first shown in his theater turned out to be Adam Sandler's The Water Boy. The business started marginally, but soon took off quickly, serving 150 meals in an hour to over 800 meals. The quality of the food also became an issue. What to serve them? After seven years of persistent lobbying for the rights to show first-run movies, he debuted the first studio movie grill in Addison in 1999. SMG boasted state-of-the-art Dolby Digital surround systems in every theater, an award-winning extensive menu with a full-service bar, and a waitstaff that could be contacted with the push of a button. By January of 2008, Studio Movie Grill had five locations in Addison, Houston, Louisville, Plano, and anchoring the Arlington Highlands development, as well as opening three new ground-up movie grills later that year in Dallas, Frisco, and Houston. The menu at SMG includes specials, drinks, starters, salads, entrees, pizzas, desserts, brunch, and even a kid's menu. By 2017, Studio Movie Grill had expanded to 24 locations and had 244 movie screens in 9 states. By 2019, SMG would have 30 locations and would have fresh investment funding for a new loyalty program, SMG Access, and plans for a launch of its own in-house subscription service. With the company enjoying success and expanding into more markets, the COVID-19 pandemic the next year brought its expansion to a halt. In October of 2020, Studio Movie Grill filed for bankruptcy. The dine-in movie theater chain stated that it was nearly out of money because of the COVID-19 pandemic. Keeping audiences away, they would only be able to operate 22 of their 33 locations at that point. During the pandemic, many of his locations stayed open for food delivery orders. Founder Brian Schultz would leave the company, handing over control to longtime CFO and COO Ted Croft. Schultz would go on to open Look Dine-In Cinemas. 
In April of 2021, the company announced that they had emerged from bankruptcy. Today, SMG has over 5,400 employees, 20 locations earning revenues of over $257 million, and they're in California, Florida, Georgia, Texas, Pennsylvania, and Illinois. Thank you for watching. If you like this content, and if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Thanks.